Welcome back to my kitchen. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to fry an egg. First up we're going to get a pan with a little bit of oil, knob of butter, heat off. We don't want the butter to burn, but we want it to uh, to fry the egg. And we want enough butter in there to coat the top and the bottom. I'm also going to do some uh, tomatoes. They're just going to sit there and cook themselves. And we're just going to wait for that to uh, to warm up. As tomatoes take longer than the egg. So we'll come back when that one's a bit closer done. Right, we'll change of plan. I'm going to uh, cook, the, cook it in oil only. And this is a cold pressed vegetable oil. The butter was uh, beginning to burn, which I wasn't happy about. That trick about putting oil and butter together doesn't work. So I just wiped out the pan. And I uh, got rid of all of the, uh, the milk solids from the bottom of the pan. Put the tomatoes back in. Put them heat down. Put it onto a smaller flame. And to that I'm going to add the egg. To the egg I'm going to add some salt. A little bit of black pepper. Just get a spoon. I think what we'll do is we'll finish it with the butter rather than starting from the, from uh, the beginning with it. You can see you're still getting a little bit of uh, runny white bit. I'm not a big fan of uh, runny whites. So what I'm going to do, try and peel it off the yolk. Very carefully. And you get the best of both worlds. Peel it off very carefully. Stand up the white bit. Flip it if you have to. The whites need to be fully cooked in my opinion. Once you're done with that, knob of butter, melt the butter in the pan. I'm holding the camera with one hand and trying to work with the other so ideally I'd like to be able to baste it which would involve tilting the pan which I won't be able to do so let's try and make do with that you see the yerk is still 
Honey, I like to break it in the pan. And that point switch it off. Grab a plate. I'll grab a serving spoon. Clean plate. Tomatoes. And an English muffin. That's it.